There is no denying the fact that India is heavily dependent on the monsoons. The country receives most of its rain during the monsoon season in a distributed manner. 60% of India is expected to be living in towns and cities by 2025. Municipal authorities are finding it increasingly difficult to meet the water needs of this burgeoning urban population. Urban India has not only taken water for granted, but has exhibited little interest in rainwater harvesting despite its potential to help sustain groundwater sources. Rainwater harvesting is done mainly for two reasons. One, to store the water for later use and two, to recharge the ground. Most places in India receive moderate to good rainfall, but this rainfall occurs in short spells of high intensity. As a result, most of the rain falling on the surface either floods the area or flows away rapidly, resulting in very little or no infiltration into the soil. One of the best ways to prevent rainwater from getting wasted is to harvest it at source. The simplest of them all is to catch the water that falls on the terrace. Harvesting the rainwater falling on the terrace is an extremely easy and efficient process. All you have to do is connect the water a downtake pipe coming from the terrace to a service well through a concealed pipeline below the ground and the pipeline coming down from the terrace is led into a gully which is then connected to the concealed pipeline. That's all. And this brings in practically entire quantity of terrace water into the service well. In the absence of an open well, a percolation or recharge well could be dug within the premises to inject the rooftop water into it for groundwater recharge. These percolation or recharge wells can be constructed using cement rings readily available in the market. The need for water is decentralized and so should the sources be. Being self-reliant in water has more meaning today than ever before. Most cities in India may be water starved but most certainly are not rain starved. An effort at harvesting rainwater at the household level, however small it may be, can go a long way in reducing external dependence.